Hey everybody, this is Saul Castaneda with MCSC Green Wheels. And today we're gonna continue our series that we started with the Fox Body Mustang, started in 1979 all the way to 1983. And today we're kicking it off with the 1981, which makes it the third year for the Fox Body generation. Here come the Pacific Mustangs. They're more Mustang. than ever. High mileage Mustangs with all kinds of extras at no extra cost. Mustang. Every Pacific Mustang has power front disc brakes, reclining bucket seats, AM FM stereo, turbine wheel covers, and P metric radial tires, all at no extra cost. The Pacific Mustangs, they're more Mustang. than ever. From the world of better ideas at four. The biggest changes in 1981 was Ford Motor Company let consumers have the options to combine different options as the consumer would want. How do you top America's most popular sports car? Top it off with our Mustang Hot Top. Get over $500 off the regular sticker price when you buy a special options package, including this exciting T-roof. Get a special deal on Mustang final roofs too. They are Hot Stop. new special value buys on flip-up sunroofs. And a classy Mustang carriage roof. Hot Get great deals at your Ford dealer on Mustang Hot Top. Also in 1981 was the last year the Gia and the Cobra Mustang were made. 1981 also marked the first year in Mustang history that the hatchback outsold the coupes or the slash notchbacks. The trend continued throughout the third generation Mustang production until 1993. Some of the changes that came in 1981 for the Ford Fox body were it was the first year that the hatchback and the notch came with T-tops. You're at the wheel of America's most popular sports car, Mustang. Mustang. Engineered for seat of the pants response with rack and pinion steering. Mustang, a car that bites when cornered. Precision tuned. Mustang turns high mileage into Mustang from the world of better ideas at four. It also had a traction lock, limited slip differential, power seat, power side windows. Reclining seats became a standard equipment. Ford dropped the 2.3 turbo. 1981 was the last year the Cobra and the Geo were made in the USA. Although Ford continued marketing the Cobra in Canada as the Cobra GT. By doing this, Ford kept the trademark which prevented the Cobra from going into the open market. 1981 engine models for the Mustang were the 2.3 four-cylinder two-valve. That came with a T4 transmission and it produced about 88 horsepower. The 3.3 six-cylinder with the one valve also came with a T4 transmission and it produced 91 horsepower. The 4.2 V8 two-valve with a C4 automatic transmission produced 115 horses with 190 foot-pounds of torque with the exception of the California models producing 205 foot-pounds of torque. Models in 1981 were the Cobra which only 1,000 821 including the non-geo models were made at a whopping price of seven thousand six hundred and forty one dollars the t-top coupe two thousand four hundred and twenty two estimated the t-top hatchback Mustang. the sky's the limit for 1981 now mustangs available with a rakish new t-roof mustang Born to run with the wind, sure-footed to handle quick turns. Mustang, a world of high gas mileage you might not expect from such a high-spirited car. Only 12,352 estimated made came at about $6,566. The two-door sedan, 77,458 were made. Those came in at $5,897. The third door, or the hatchback, 77,399 estimated made, and those came in at $6,566. The two-door sedan Gia, that was 13,422 made, they came in at $6,786. Third door hatchback Gia was 14,273 of those made, 
The total amount of cars made in 1981 was 182,522 Mustangs. That's what was sold in 81, which is obviously a lower number than 1980, which was 2,271,322 units were sold in 1980. For the 1981, which is the third year of the Fox body, production only a few changes were made. The Ford customers were just given more freedom to have and to combine different style options to create a Mustang that was distinctly, as they would say, theirs. I want to thank everybody on our Facebook page. Guys, go on there if you're looking for one of these classic cars out there. We post as many as we can. I want to thank everybody, especially on our Instagram. Guys, keep going, put in the comments. Keep following us, we'll keep producing this content. And everybody right here, remember guys, subscribe and subscribe right here on our YouTube channel. Guys, we will see you again with 1982.